Thank you, Danny, and good afternoon, ladies and gentlemen. The current pandemic continues to drive consumer adoption towards the digital. E-commerce, online services, and electronic payments gain stronger traction by the day. For businesses, being agile and keeping pace with the changes will be vital. It can spell survival and recovery or the business's demise. Digital will undoubtedly play a center stage role and many businesses have already accelerated their digital investments in response to this heightened market inflection. As this takes shape, the need to build transformation over a rock-solid foundation has become top of mind among many business and IT leaders. To be able to handle the exponential increase in data traffic, to ensure utmost reliability to support non-stop operations, and ultimately deliver the best possible digital experience. PLD Enterprise continues to pave the way towards the next normal as we provide our customers with the most robust fiber network infrastructure and solutions that are geared to make all of this possible. Consider the ongoing transformation within our banks, a key sector and economy enabler. This industry has clearly gone more digital. As we speak, more than 40% of our population are already into online banking, with another 30% already actively on board various mobile payment services. This explains why digital investments within the sector is on the rise. Close to two-thirds of our local banks are pursuing transformational projects to enhance their digital capabilities, and that number just continues to increase. The emerging hybrid bank model of physical and digital has become the new normal and it demands a far superior connectivity technology to help tune the bank's corporate network for peak performance. Always on availability and optimized customer experiences have become the minimum expectation, regardless if the transaction is over the counter, an ATM, or through the online banking app. Traditional networks won't cut it anymore, and that's why we are seeing the rush among our banking customers to move towards SD1, and for good reasons. First, there's network management simplicity. SD1 enables a centralized approach to manage and automate the entire banking network ecosystem with much better intelligence and full application visibility. By making use of configuration templates, headquarters, branches, ATMs, cloud-based applications, and data center networks spread over wide geographical locations can now be provisioned and controlled with just a few clicks from a centralized dashboard. Second, it's the flexibility to leverage any underlying network service, such as MPLS, fiber broadband, LTE and 5G. Better yet, a blend of multiple transport options can be used to enable a best-in-class, highly resilient corporate network. PLDT Enterprise's unique advantage of being the country's only fully integrated telco allows us to deliver all of this and more to help customers take full advantage of this promising technology. Third, SD1 optimizes data traffic flow and enables dynamic routing to ensure maximum uptime and best network performance. What about mission critical applications? SD1 can definitely handle and put the necessary prioritization around that, reducing the chance of financial loss due to downtime. Lastly, we recognize that security is of paramount importance to the industry. By default, SD1 separates the control plane from the data plane to make sure that our customers' data is isolated within their network and compliant to global standards. Our SD1 platform likewise integrates security capabilities such as encrypted VPN tunnels and application firewalls. Today, PLED is also pioneering SASE, Secure Access Service Edge architecture, to make sure that stringent security policies are enforced across all users and devices 
while at the same time leveraging on our cybersecurity capabilities and best practices. Let's tackle another interesting industry. The retail sector, alongside quick service restaurants, present interesting transformation use cases. With current restrictions on mobility, a large subset of consumers have opted to resort to online shopping and food delivery service. In retail, e-commerce continues to grow fast with online stores getting close to 32 million additional visits and online sales increasing more than 80% compared to previous years. Quick service restaurants or QSRs are fast recovering, albeit following a different course from the traditional dining model. Online ordering, curbside pickup, and food delivery are now the new drivers. New customer channel trends continue to emerge including social media integration, niche apps, crypto-based food orders, and many more. Meanwhile, both are still pressed to maintain cost-effective operations and continue to find reliable ways to manage sales reports, deliveries, and inventories remotely. PLET Enterprise continues to enable these digital experiences. Using SD1, We've made our customers' IT networks very easy to manage. Through our branch in a box platform, businesses now have dashboard access to equipment telemetry, configuration settings, auto updates, and troubleshooting tools, all at the click of a button. Using specific configuration templates for stores, offices, and remote workers, we have made it extremely simple to spin up, scale, and connect additional sites into their corporate networks. This is in lieu of traditional command line algorithms, drastically reducing the complexity and heavy lifting that IT and network managers need to bear. As for security, we've deployed auto VPN capabilities and unified threat management that make secure connections for sales reporting and access to FTP servers as easy as possible. PLET Enterprise's branch in the box platform simplifies the delivery of critical IT infrastructure to quickly digitalize business operations. It fosters what we call the lean IT movement, empowering businesses to mobilize the right IT infrastructure quickly and allowing them to manage their IT ecosystem in the simplest way possible. A crucial piece to the solutions we have discussed so far is the underlying connectivity foundation. Digital platforms and ecosystems will only be as reliable as a network backbone that bonds them together. This is where our Beyond Fiber delivers a clear competitive edge. Powered by our industry-leading fiber infrastructure, Beyond Fiber redefines broadband and provides business-grade internet for all our enterprise customers. But what exactly sets Beyond Fiber a cut above the rest? Well, our Beyond Fiber was designed and built to be three times more reliable for businesses. It comes with our unique 9090 service promise, which essentially means you get a minimum speed equivalent to 90% of your subscribed bandwidth at 90% service reliability. This is currently unmatched by any other commercial offer out there, which can only commit to a service promise of 30% minimum speed at 80% service reliability. Let me cite an example to give you a um, clearer picture. Broadband packages are typically advertised based on burst speeds. So a uh, 50 Mbps offer, let's say, means you can hit up to 50 Mbps under normal traffic conditions without congestion. In the event of congestion, however, attaining burst speeds starts to become a challenge. And this is when the provider's minimum speed caveat starts to kick in. Just to further concretize, 
let's put our 50Mbps Beyond Fiber side by side with a regular 50Mbps fiber offer out there and determine how each will behave in the event of congestion. The regular 50 Mbps offer goes down to a minimum 30% of the subscribed speed, which means the user will diminish to 15 Mbps. Beyond Fiber, however, in the same situation, will only slightly go down to 90% of the subscribed bandwidth, which in this case translates to 45 Mbps. Now that's clearly three times faster still. Come to think of it, even if you compare it with a regular 100 Mbps option, Beyond Fiber will still outperform it on baseline minimum speed, as chances are it will go down to 30 Mbps. The combination of Beyond Fiber, Branch in a Box, and SD1 allows us to provide the most resilient connectivity solution for this industry. In fact, we were able to help cut down network incident reports across customers whom we've gotten on board by as much as 20% in the past year alone. Finally, there is business process outsourcing, which remains one of the most important industry sectors in the country. The BPO sector provides one of the most interesting use cases as they transition towards work from home and a hybrid workplace. One of their top challenges is how to replicate the ideal corporate office environment within agents' home offices, providing them with secure and reliable connections and the best possible work-from-home solution staff in order to maintain productivity levels and service quality consistency. PLT Enterprise comes in with solutions to cater to these work arrangements. Fiber connectivity became the bedrock of the work from home revolution. With Beyond Fiber, you can just imagine the positive effects it brings to workforce reliability, unhampered UIP calls, optimal video and chat experience, and streamlined data transactions all make for a robust distributed workforce operations that is poised for productivity and customer service excellence. Let's see how my colleagues are doing with their work from home setting. Hi guys, how's work from home so far? I have been doing all my meetings here at home since stricter lockdowns were imposed. Same here, Gary. It's been a good experience and we're still able to get things done in the comfort of our homes. All right, thanks for the update, guys. To resist the challenge of extending the corporate land environment to the home office, we turn again to the capabilities of SD1 and AIP. To date, we have deployed teleworker gateways across thousands of our customers' home offices, which allow IT managers to easily replicate and enforce corporate policies to remote workers. Built-in capabilities such as Layer 3 and application firewalls, group policies, and encrypted tunneling all work together to make this possible. We've also wrapped managed service desk capabilities around these network solutions to deliver proactive monitoring and restoration services, which have become crucial to highly distributed nationwide operations that many BTOs find themselves in. This combination of solutions has allowed BPO companies to pivot effectively. They are able to enforce corporate policies, provide quality of service for both voice and data, and ultimately ensure that their technology investments are fast, secure, and optimized wherever their employees may be. Empowering the enterprise through our robust fiber network and solutions portfolio is not confined to the examples I shared. The benefits cut across many different sectors which are also undergoing transformation. There is movement across the different localities to transform towards becoming smart cities and smart LGUs. They leverage on fiber-powered connectivity to bridge the line and address the digital divide within their respective constituencies. There's the academe, where connectivity has become the essential conduit 
that enabled education and learning to continue and allowed knowledge bases to be pooled and shared. There's healthcare, there's public sector, and there's many more that will follow. This transformation will transcend the pandemic as it is the nature of businesses to evolve continuously. After all, it is the only way to survive and thrive. As the future unfolds and as your transformation takes shape, PLET Enterprise will always be fully behind you. We will continue to enable and help build the fiber-powered enterprise and carry on with our thrust to deliver true resilience.